force programs to use in go through proxy. My school requires a proxy for all internet access. If you want to use the internet, it is impossible to not use a proxy. This makes it a problem for many programs that don't seem to let you enter proxy settings. How can I use Steam when I am behind a proxy? Is it possible to somehow enter the details into a configuration file or force it to get the settings from Internet Explorer? If not, does software exist for creating a virtual network adapter which will pass all traffic or all protocol X traffic through the proxy? Although I am facing this specific problem on Windows 7, solutions for all operating systems are welcome. Check out Proxifier. Combined with an SSH tunnel, you should be able to get most programs through any proxy. My school, and all the others in my state, have a quite elaborate web filtering proxy setup which blocks most ports on the other side of the proxy. I managed to get around it using a combination of the programs mentioned above on Windows. Just create an SSH tunnel using PuTTY as necessary, and then set Proxifier to use the tunnel as its proxy. This should route traffic of all ports through the proxies. My Tongue 2 Socks software, Linux, Windows, creates a virtual network interface that forwards all incoming TCP connections through a specified proxy server. It can only use a Socks proxy, and by default can only forward TCP though UDP can be forwarded too if you are able to run my UDCore forwarder somewhere behind the socks. Assuming you meet those requirements, here's how you can set it up. First create a virtual interface and configure it. On Linux. Or, on Windows, just install OpenFM to get the TapWin32 virtual interface, and assign it IP 10.0.0.1. Netmask 255.255.255.0 Then start TUN2 socks, which does the actual forwarding. Here, 10.0.0.2 is the IP of the virtual router inside the virtual interface. It must be in the same subnet as, and different from, the one assigned to the virtual interface itself, 10.0.0.124. On Windows, instead of TUN0, use. At this point you should be able to ping the virtual router, 10.0.0.2, in which case the running TUN2 SOX program will be the one to respond. To forward connections through the proxy, all you have to do is route them through the virtual device. On Linux. Or on Windows. The critical part here is that the route overrides any existing default route. Also, if your SOC server is not on the local network, you have to add an exception route with higher metric to prevent connections from being routed back into the virtual interface. See the link at the top for more information. For Windows there is a free utility called CAP. CAP, a free proxy software providing support to SOX 5, Shadow SOX, etc. A free alternative to proxy software like Proxifier or STEP. Also a lightweight alternative to VPN. Supports from Windows XP to Windows 10. Redirect connections from of any internet app. You should configure it for programs which you want to go through your proxy. Your best bet is to set the proxy info in Internet Settings and Control Panel. If your uni uses a proxy configuration script then you can navigate to that file in your web browser and check out the manual settings or you can run with the script and hope for the best. Steam should work after that. My uni only recently prevented non-proxy Steam access so that they could throttle Steam download speeds. Frown.